about to see Claudia Colombo, who is an esthetician and a wellness expert to get facial extractions for the very first time. I'm gonna be honest and say I do pick at my face quite often, so like, I feel like I'm not nervous, but I've also never had someone else pick at my face for me, so I, do, I think it's gonna feel weird. It's probably gonna feel weird. So after the treatment, I'm gonna check back in with you guys a week from now to see how the results have lasted, if my skin looks any better, and I'll let you know if this treatment is worth it. Now, extractions is basically the removal of impacted pores. Most facials include extractions and pretty much everybody needs some form of extraction. So I started with some lymph drainage, then I went into some gentle cleansing, and then I pre-soften the skin to make it easier for the pores to be extracted. So after her pores were softened with the enzyme treatment that I used, the digestive enzymes work really well to soften and just kind of liquefy the pores. Then we did the ultrasonic skin scrubber and that just um, helped the, to liquefy the pores even more. did the extractions, everything, everything came out really easily, there was no pressure, you don't have to you know, put a lot of pressure into the extraction, and everything came out beautifully. After the cleaning and after the extractions, I want to remineralize the skin and just add all the nutrients the skin needs. So I did some a chlorophyll and copper complex. I find uh, with Nico, she had a little bit of a deficiency with magnesium and copper. And normally, if there's blackheads present and um, a lot of like blemishes and acne, that's usually uh, key that those minerals are, are you're deficient in. So we did that, it incubated in the skin a little bit, and then we used a blue light to help heal, um, help heal the skin even more and help those products and ingredients to penetrate deeper into the pores. And then we topped it off with a hydrogelly mask. The hydrogelly masks are really popular right now in, in, in skincare, and I love them because it really calms the skin, it's very soothing. I hope the expectation of extractions is that you leave with glowing, radiant, healthy skin, and that's the objective. Um, that's why you should get a professional extraction done. Um, we have professional tools, professional ingredients, things that you can't do at home. So I really advise at least one professional assessment um, to kind of start you off on the journey of better skin, just so your unique condition can be looked at professionally and you can understand your skin better and then therefore take care of it properly long term. So those pickers, those pickers, um, I would say please, please, please do the best you can to keep your hands off your skin because you're only going to make things worse. Sometimes you think, you know, it's a specific blemish or it's a blackhead and it's nothing of the sorts. It's something completely different. So you don't really know what you're actually poking and picking at. So 
it has been a week since my extraction facial with Claudia and I have to say that I have noticed a pretty huge difference in my skin, specifically with the texture. Before, obviously, my nose was very covered in blackheads. Anytime I looked in the mirror, it felt like they were pretty obvious. But afterwards, it was like they were almost non-existent. Like, I can barely see any blackheads on my skin right now. I feel like my skin is also starting to look a lot better because of the tips and tricks Claudia gave me during the facial. So like, drinking more water, more lymphatic draining, and less picking at my face has obviously helped make a difference in my skin too. I would say that even going this one time helped me a ton because I just learned so much about how to keep the blackheads at bay at home without Claudia's help. So the next time that I feel the need to pick at my dirty, dirty skin, I can just sit down and watch like a Dr. Pimple Popper compilation, pretend I'm her and get it out of my head. And I feel like my skin will thank me for it. Mm -hmm.